The Elevator. <laughs> From time to time, I like to dabble in erotic fiction. I do this because I am a romantic at heart, and because it gets me off. <laughs> You're in an elevator with a pretty girl. As the doors close, you both reach for the same button. When you do, your fingers brush against each other. A graze, no more. She smiles, embarrassed, and looks away. Well, well, looks like you're heading to the same floor. A shared destination. <laughs> Kismet. The two of you are alone. As the elevator begins its ascent, your mind races, stealing glances at her from the corner of your... your, your, your. <laughs> You wonder how to speak to this delectable creature. What can you say to bewitch her as much as she has enchanted you? The words, when they come, are perfect. Same floor, huh? <laughs> A breath, the scent of lilacs as she turns to you. Her response fills you with delight. Huh? She says. <laughs> You waggle your freshly waxed eyebrows at her and dive mischievously <laughs> toward the elevator wall. Same floor. You and me. Her dappled eyes go to the button, the only button lit, and she says, I guess. <laughs> Indeed, you say with confidence. You have made contact. It is now only a matter of time before your bodies are entwined in divine rapture, perhaps in this very elevator or perhaps in some dim alcove on the floor above, the floor that the two of you share, the floor that you race toward, even now. A breath, no more than a breath, before she turns to you and says, there are only two floors. <laughs> and so there are. She is magnificent, beautiful, and brilliant. From what star did this golden light first emerge? Across what vast distance did it travel to find you here? She continues, so obviously we're going to the same floor. But angels were not meant to be captured so easily. She clearly likes the chase. <laughs> so chase you shall. It wasn't obvious to me, you say, as you let just the tiniest dribble of tobacco juice slide out of your mouth. <laughs> Just enough so that it catches the light dripping into your plastic dip cup. <laughs> and a deference to you. Listen, a-hole, she says. This hospital only has two floors. Ground floor and upstairs where I get my effing chemotherapy. That's what I was going to lose. She starts crying. And coughing. I ride the rest of the way in silence. It is a very slow 